You might have noticed that there are some options in the order screen that we haven't explained to you yet. This is the video to help you understand them. Let's start with an example. Maybe you have just bought your favorite stocks and now want to go on vacation. Obviously, you'll have other things in mind than checking the stock market all the time. You don't want to come back only to see that the stock value has dropped and you have lost your whole investment. So just create a stop loss order to sell automatically as soon as the price drops below a certain value. This will prevent huge losses and you can enjoy that vacation. You can use the same principle for other use cases as well. For example, if you want to buy a stock, but it is too expensive at the moment, you can simply create a buy limit order. We'll buy the stock as soon as the price drops below your specified value. Here you can see how the buy limit order works in detail. As soon as the price drops below your specified value, the stocks are bought automatically. Easy, right? The last type of order that we're going to explain in this video is the limit order. Sometimes it's also called a take profit order. A limit order is useful if you have bought a stock and automatically want to sell it as soon as you have made profit. Simply enter the price and we will sell your stocks as soon as the stock value rises above it. Don't worry, you don't need to memorize all the types of orders. Our app tells you when your order will be executed in a dynamic text on the order screen. 